Well, what did you think of my first lame YouTube video? I'm pretty proud of myself, actually. He 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 ha ha ha. All right, so what are we doing for the next two weeks? Uh, while I'm gone, we're going to talk about naming compounds. So I figured we'd start off with what is a compound? Remember how we said that there were two different types of matter? Pure versus mixture, right? Now, we're not going to deal with mixtures. We're only going to deal with pure compounds. Now, pure compounds are broken down into elements compounds. Okay, Elements are just one kind of atom. So if I've got a bunch of atoms that are all exactly the same, that's an element. Now, compounds, I can have different elements that are bonded together. Okay, so like let's say that I had a blue atom, uh, let's call it nitrogen, and I had a green atom, actually let's say I had two green atoms, and that's oxygen. So I had two different types of atoms, but they're stuck together. They're stuck together forever, permanently bonded together. Well, let's say that I had another thing over here that was exactly the same. And then I had another one over here that was exactly the same. Each unit may have more than one kind of element, but they're all the same. All the units are the same as each other, so they're compounds. Compounds are pure substances. The question here is, how do we name them? Because it would be pretty bad if we had all these compounds in the world, but we never knew how to name them, right? We'd be confused all the time. Oh, is it this compound or that compound? What exactly are we talking about? That's the essence of what we're trying to do here this week. We're going to have different compounds, and I'm going to show you how to name them. Now, the video that I've listed on there for ionic bonding, that video is really good. This guy's going to teach you what ionic bonding is, and basically he's going to show you that there are different types of bonds that compounds can make. Please pay attention to that video. He does a much better job making videos than I do. And uh, if you still have trouble, go down and talk to Captain Barclay. I want to keep these videos short, and I want to make sure that you get a chance to um, do the practice. I'm going to show you how to do the worksheet that I've included, which you can see down there under Practice Worksheet on the blog. Um, I'm going to show you how to do that in the next video. Stay tuned.